Okay, what's up YouTube? Uh, I'm gonna run uh, this Cinebank uh, benchmark for you guys to show the uh, performance on the i7 at 4.3 GHz and it's actually stable at 4.3 GHz so I could run this 24-7 because my uh, 920 just uses 1.272 volts at 4.3 so my my i7 is really, really special, actually. Uh, you know, I've seen people using uh, 1.4 volts at 4.2 GHz. Uh, so, you know, I'm really a lucky bastard. But I have to wait for the 5870 like February. So, I'm, I guess I'm not that lucky, but. Uh, I'm just gonna show that later. Now we're gonna run the Cinebank. And I'm using a retard resolution because I can't show the uh, time and uh, the temps otherwise because the camera's focus is so bad. Okay. So here we go. And we got the temps. I'm using real temp. Speed fan is, uh, you know, not accurate. This is actually, this is accurate temps. So, the high 60s, you know, 70s. You can see it's almost done already. Uh, you can see the time there. 30, 31, 32, 33, 4, 5, boom. Boom, it's done. So, 35 seconds. You see there? So, if you want to beat that, you know, 24 7 stable system, 35 seconds. My, my 920 is crazy. Okay, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna show you the, uh, here, so you believe me. Of course you will because Cinebank went so fast, but you know the voltage. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna run uh, Prime here, just to get the multiply going. Uh, okay. <coughs> so here, you can see 4.3 gigahertz. Okay, the base clock is at 205, uh, 204.8 actually, but you know, 205. And the multiplier is 21, so it's maxed out multiplier. Uh, and the core voltage 1.272. Okay. I ran prime one hour at this voltage. Okay. So it didn't work at 1.26, it crashed, so I you know, just pushed it up a little bit. And it's stable. <laughs> it's ridiculous, actually. It's ridiculous. Okay. So the temps, you're wondering, while Prime is going. And uh, all threads are working now. You can see there, load 100%. And you know, it's hyper threading on, so all the 8 cores, 8 threads, all the 8 threads are running 100%. So it's the mid 70s. Uh, this core is actually a lot cooler than the others for some reason. But uh, well, it's going up to the like 80s and uh, when it's past like an hour. But you know uh, the i7 can take that. And you ain't gonna run 100% and hyper threading on games anyways. So 80 is a safe level. Okay, bye.